go. Yes, so. Doing it. This is my favorite game. Okay, so I created a Arcanist. It's a new character. Um, I just want to go through the tutorial real quick. See what's going on. How this Arcanist is going to play. Um, so... I know I've been doing uh, before, so I just wanted to do some ESO. I really missed it. I ain't played it in a minute. So I hope y'all are enjoying this. There you are. On your feet. I know magical translocation can really upset the stomach. Just take a moment and get your bearings, all right? Where am I? The Isle of Balfiera, home of Clan Berini. I apologize for the cramped accommodations. We pride ourselves on courtesy, but circumstances here have taken a turn for the bazaar. I needed to make sure you weren't a danger to yourself or others. Not a danger. Can you please let me out? You might not be so eager to escape once you hear what's going on. You uh -oh. arrive via a portal, along with a deatric beast called Shyazel. It seized control of our golems and unleashed them on the island. If I free you, will you help me stop Shyazel? Yes, I'd be free. I'll help you. Wise choice. Just give me a moment. There. That should unlock the door. When you're ready, follow me. Okay. Named her Jolly Jelly. <laughs> there you are. Free as a spring cricket. I hope you intend to keep your word. We'll need each other out there. Of that, I'm certain. The name's Norianwe, by the way, of Clan Dorini. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Where are we headed? We're bound for a place called the Keyrite's Gallery. But first, I need to know you can defend yourself. Hurtling through the Orbis and falling flat on your ear left you a bit scattered. Find a weapon, and we'll work out the cobwebs. Fair. Sounds fair enough. But I have some questions. Of course. I can't promise total transparency, but I'll be as forthcoming as I can. You mentioned Keyrite's Gallery. What is that place? The Keyrite's Gallery is an ancient substructure of Balfiera Island, built long before my clan arrived. Why is it called the Keyrite's Gallery? On account of all the doors. The gallery's full of ancient gates, each with some arcane connection to places in Tamriel and beyond. Once the gates came to life, rifts opened. You fell out of one of them. The Daedra, Shyazel, emerged from another. How did you escape? I cast an incantation of the steed, snatched you up, and fled as fast as my feet would carry me. I heard the Daedra cursing, followed by some kind of explosion, but I didn't look back. I hope the gallery is still standing. Yeah. Nothing irresponsible, if that's what you're asking. I'm a member of Clan Dorini's Intelligence Guild, the Cinderil. More scholar than spy, I assure you. I was conducting some research in the gallery, then pop! You and that monster arrived. <laughs> Why were you studying this The gallery's place? always been a place of special interest for the guild, but we never quite cracked how it worked. Despite the dangers, this is our greatest breakthrough to date. The guild master will be ecstatic, provided we get it under control. You said something about golems. What is going on here exactly? Would it frustrate you to hear that I have no idea? We Dureni are cautious by nature, so the Isle of Bolfiera has many defenses. Magical stone guardians protect many of our sacred sites, but somehow this Daedra found a way to turn them against us. Can you describe the Daedra to Chazelle? Oh, do I have to? 
If I recall my studies correctly, I'd say it's a harvester. A huge serpentine creature that feeds on souls and magicka. If it finds a way to consume the energies of the gallery, we will be in very serious trouble. Sounds like it. Okay, let's go get us a weapon. Boy. Ooh, fire step. Dagger. Cool. Larger weapons like staves and great axes will take both hands to use. You can pair smaller weapons with a shield or another weapon of that size. The choice is yours. It's mine. And I've made it. No use letting that weapon rattle around in your pack. Equip it, then I'll help you work out the cobwebs. Hold your all, it's been a minute. Yes, I think that one suits you. If you change your mind, feel free to take any other weapon you want. Now, let's find a spot to practice. Excellent. Oh y'all, here we go. So this guy, where'd she go? Come on. This is as good a place as any. Yes. Now, prepare yourself. Well, I conjure up a dance partner. Let me back up the bus. Let's begin. Mm. Oh. Well done. Attack. Top mark. Brilliant. Now do it again. I'll beat you. There you go. Strike quality. Wait a minute. Back up. You're unnatural. Damn. Protect Bust yourself. Yep. Use your heaviest That's attack. Raw strength, that. Wonderful. Keep up the defense. Strike hard. Now. Now some foes will try to restrain you. Quickly break ha! <laughs> You're unstoppable. I'll beat you. Prepare yourself. <laughs> you broke loose. Again, make ready. You're every bit the warrior I thought you'd be. What's going on? Again, now press yep. your neck. There you go. It's like falling on your back, oh, don't you? Powerful <laughs> strike. Quickly now, when your enemy prepares an attack, strike. Interrupting their attack will set them off balance. Good, now destroy it. I'm going to destroy it. Come <laughs> speak with me for a moment. One skill. Nope. With moves like that, the Daedra doesn't stand a chance. Yes, I'd say we're ready to set out. Where are we headed to? To now? reach the Key Rides Gallery. We have to make it out of this ruin and across a wide field full of the golems I mentioned. With any luck, we'll be able to slip past them. But I'm not all that lucky, so I'm sorry in advance. 
All right. So head there next. What can we expect to enter in? Well, it begins with the door, the first of many. The only way to access the gallery is through a mysterious gateway. Once we pass through that initial door, we'll step into a huge vault. This is the part that worries me most. What is it I believe Shiazel, the Daedric creature that's causing all this mischief, may have nested itself in there. So be prepared to fight. We'll deal with Shiazel. Pacify the Golem. I can't say anything with certainty, but ridding the world of an otherworldly abomination can't hurt, right? Its influence might linger for a time, but the Golems should return to normal before too long. Hopefully. Let's go. I don't want to. I got some money. Some birds. One of the stray golems. We might want to sneak past it. Oh. Trap! Sneaky little bug. Who's beating on the door over there? Said sneak past it. Set them off. Almost there. Let's hurry. Right. The entrance to the Kirides Gallery should be east of here. Let's set out. Very, very sensitive. Like, super sensitive. The Kirites Gallery is in here. Let's head inside. Oh, 
Well, this is upsetting. Jess's bones, the surge of magicka created by the portals you came through. Uh, must have cracked this sky shard. Without a functioning sky shard, this gate remains locked, and there's no way for us to proceed. Damn! Is there a way to fix it? Unless you have a set of enchanting tools and a working knowledge of meteoric empowerment theory, no, there's nothing for it. We need to find a replacement. Where can we find a replacement sky shard? I saw one in a vault just south of here a few days ago, but it was flanked by one of the island's more powerful golems. Normally, I'd say we should search for another option, but given the circumstances, I think we have to risk it. Great, let's find that sky shard. Can I ask you something before we head out? Of course. Let's not tarry too long, though. What are sky shards exactly? Giant clusters of meteoric glass. They fall from Aetherius, charged with raw and very potent magicka. Mages use sky shards in all kinds of rituals and experiments. We Dureni use them as a power source. What kind of golem here's the sky shard? It's a monstrous sentinel called a gargoyle. I've never seen one fight, but by all accounts, they are far more powerful than the golems we faced thus far. Right, sounds like the plan. I promise y'all I will fix this mouse. It is too. Do it at the moment. All right. Do you see that vault to the south? The sky shot is there. There it is, the sky shot. Uh -oh. Absorb the energy of that shard. I did. Sorry. Not quite what I intended, but we can work with this. Let's head back to the gate. Happy. 
so excited for this. The new character and the new If y'all are already playing it, let me know if you're playing it already. and unlock the gate. I'm afraid we've reached the really scary bit. The Daedric creature responsible for all these portals waits just beyond that gate. If you have any other preparations to make, make them now. Sounds good. Again, I'm just a scholar, but I'd encourage you to remember what we practiced before. Keep moving, strike true, and exploit any opening the creature gives you. Like a point? I don't know about the whole moving thing. I'm not much of a mover and shaker. I know some people are. It's not. Uh, and it gets me killed. I accept it. Aware of it. And I accept it. There it is. Send it back to oblivion. Just send it back to oblivion. Yeah. Wither and die. You wither and die. You cannot kill. I will you kill you. Die. You will die. See? All that talk. You did it. Hopefully the gallery wasn't too badly damaged. Follow me. the stars. Look at the central column. I had no idea it was concealing something like this. Let's get a closer look. I thought that's the way we came. People. I was like, did you stop reading? <laughs> this is what we do. I'll get to my no enough. We never managed to unlock the gates. Their power comes from this arcane helix. Amazing. With the helix exposed, these gates can finally reopen. Perhaps not all of them at first, but enough to reach most of Tamriel. The question for you, I suppose, is where to first? Can you believe this? Just look around. With this arcane helix exposed, the chamber is positively crackling with magic. The Keyrite's gallery has come to life, and I finally think I know why. What do you mean? I did it come to life? Because of you, matters in Tamriel are bleak. War rages in Cyrodiil. Daedric princes conspire. Dragons ride the winds of elsewhere. The second era needs a savior. I believe the gallery. 
perhaps even the adamantine tower itself chose you. I think I should do that. The Keyrite's gallery opened doors to every corner of Tamriel, places I suspect that desperately need a hero's aid. This choice is yours to make, but wherever you choose to go, I'm sure adventure awaits. May the stars protect you. So, have you chosen where to go? What region of the world strikes your fancy? Not everyone gets to pass instantly from one side of Tamriel to another, you know. This is quite a gift. You plan to use one of the doors as well? What, me? No, I've got work to do. The Cinderil will want every bit of this place searched and studied. Since I did the discovering, I'll probably end up leading the effort. Adventure abroad sounds all well and good, but my place is here. You really think fate brought me here? Well, fate's sort of a clumsy way to put it. No offense. Honestly, we may never know why you were chosen, but I believe there was intention here. Something, whether it be the stars, the gallery, or the tower itself, placed you here for a reason. Is that what brought it here? Perhaps it followed you to prevent you from reaching your, well, destiny sounds a bit too grandiose. Let's just say to stop you from reaching your potential. Then again, maybe the power of this place brought you here to stop Shiazel. I guess we'll never know. Probably not, but what's a life without unanswered questions, right? Boring, if you ask me. Think you'll ever unravel the mysteries of this place? Ha! Huh, an elf can hope. Answering that question will probably keep me occupied for the next hundred years. Is right? the helix connected to the adamantine tower? How does it perceive distant corners of Tamriel? I may never understand it, but I'll do my best. Right, you did your best. Any thoughts on where I should go? It is a bit overwhelming, isn't it? The yeah. whole of Tamriel is stretched out before you. We could start with the political considerations. Three great alliances vie for control of Cyrodiil. Does the fate of the Pact, Covenant, or Dominion interest you? Hmm. Really not sure. I kind of like to do both, though. Excellent. You can visit Stros Mackay and Daggerfall Covenant territory, an island called Kanathi's Ruse that the Aldmeri Dominion set its eyes on, or the Ebonheart Pax Domain. On second thought, I might want to travel outside the borders of these three great alliances. I don't blame you. Interprovincial intrigue is the basis of my whole profession, and even I find it tiresome after a while. I suppose that widens the map a bit. Where else could I find adventure? Well, as I said before, threats to Tamriel have grown like weeds practically everywhere. Would you prefer to spend time among my elven kin, the Khajiit of elsewhere, or men of the north and south? What can you tell me about elsewhere? According to our spies, the land of the catfolk is in sorry shape. Imperial holdouts sit upon the throne and a rage of dragons spilled out of the halls of Colossus burning everything in their path. If it's adventure you seek, you'll find it there. You mentioned elves too. Where can I find them? If you take the gate to Vardenfell, you can meet the Dark Elves and maybe even the God King, Vivek. You could also travel south to Somerset Isle, our ancestral home and the primary seat of power for the High Elves. Is there work to do on Somerset? Always, though the natives don't make it easy. High Elves of Somerset don't share the Dorenni's pragmatism. They're often too proud to ask for help. But our agents reported some strange activity around the Crystal Tower. It's probably worth a look. Can you tell me about elsewhere? According to our spies, the land of the Catfolk is in sorry shape. Imperial holdouts sit upon the throne and a rage of dragons spilled out of the halls of Colossus, burning everything in their path. If it's adventure you seek, you'll find it there. Tell me about these realms of men 
you mentioned? Certainly. One of these gates appear to go to Western Skyrim, a hermitical kingdom of Nords led by King Svargrim. The other leads to Blackwood, at the southern tip of Cyrodiil. Imperial remnants rule there. What's happening in Western Skyrim? The Nords of Western Skyrim are inhospitable, to put it lightly. Even so, we've been able to glean a few things. I've read reports about increased vampiric activity in the region. Never a good sign. They need stout adventurers to deal with it. That was the tutorial for the new class. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thanks for watching the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you're doing in, in ESO. Okay. Bye guys.